Hey YouTube, what's up? It's dying it again, and we're gonna be doing a Flash 8 tutorial now. And I know I said that I'd do some GTA tutorials, but you know, I have to get this one out of the way, it's really cool. So, say what you wanted to do in Flash was make an object follow the mouse uh, from left to right only, and not in every direction, or up and down only, and not in every direction. Um, say you're making a game, a first person shooter, and you only wanted the gun to go left and right, not up and down. Uh, we're going to do that now, and it's going to be really quick. So, we'll create a circle, an ellipse, and we'll select that ellipse, and we'll right click and we'll go convert to symbol. And we'll, you can call this anything you like, I'll just call it ball. Alright. Uh, next, what we want to do is double click on that symbol, and select everything, and drag everything to about the center. See where that cross is? This cross right here. Just put it put the ball pretty much in the center of the cross, it doesn't really matter. Uh, go back to your scene and just put the ball there. Uh, and then we want to give it an instance name right here of ball. Okay, so also what we'll do is we'll change the frame rate to 25 frames per second since the human eye can't see any faster than that. Although I do notice a difference but people say Ah, there's no difference. Anyway, we've got that all sorted, so we'll create a new layer, layer 2, and we'll click on the first keyframe, we'll go to actions, and we'll go, uh, we'll create a new action, new function, so, on, sorry, on enter frame, so on enter frame, when the, when, ac when flash enters that frame, equals a function, and function with a lowercase f, not a capital F, because they're two different things. Uh, no arguments, so open bracket, close bracket, and then open a brace. So, all right, now we're into that code. So now what we'll do is we'll go ball on dot underscore x. So the x position of the ball is equal to underscore x mouse. So the ball's x position is always equal to uh, the exposition of the mouse. I'll just end that with a semicolon and then close that brace. And I'm pretty sure we're done here. We'll go and test that in Flash and it works. So there you go. I move my mouse up and down. It doesn't follow. I move my mouse left and right and it does follow. So it's pretty nice if you're making a little game. Alright, thanks for watching and subscribe, comment, and rate. And uh, I'll see you next time with a GTA video, probably. So that'll be good. We'll do some animation and stuff. That'll be fun. So, see you later.